Hello, I'm Dr. Jackie Vanderloot. Hi, and my name is Brian Room. Today we will be discussing a sensitive analysis of the cylinder test, paw dragging. The cylinder test is a test of forelimb motor function in rodents. In this test, mice explore a plexiglass cylinder by rearing and using their forepaws for postural support against the cylinder wall. Examining forepaw use while the mouse explores the cylinder allows us to determine if the mouse has motor deficits. Specifically, we compare the use of each forepaw before and after stroke. Following a stroke, the forepaw contralateral to the injured hemisphere is used less often. This change in use of the affected forepaw versus the unaffected forepaw is a measure of forelimb asymmetry. Currently, forelimb asymmetry analysis is used in mice and rats after large ischemic injuries such as middle cerebral artery occlusion as a behavioral determinant of stroke. In contrast to large injuries, forelimb asymmetry is not observed in mice with small focal ischemic injuries. This may be due to the fact that forelimb asymmetry analysis of the cylinder test is sensitive to large injuries but is not useful in detecting smaller injuries. Small focal ischemic injuries such as photothrombosis and endothelin-1 induced ischemia are becoming more popular in most models. This highlights a need for functional behavioral assays to assess these smaller cortical injuries. In my lab, Brian Room has developed a novel analysis of the cylinder test we call paw dragging. By examining how the mouse's forepaws contact the...